Greetings, myself Dr. Srujan Duple, consultant pediatrician at Manipal Hospital, Karadi. So we'll be talking about allergic march, also called as atopic march. Uh, this is a group of allergic disorder which starts in childhood and progresses into adulthood. So basically, it starts in newborn period. You have atopic dermatitis, also called as eczema. So it progresses into food allergies during initial few months of period and then it in progresses into respiratory allergic disorders such as allergic rhinitis and asthma. The question is do babies outgrow these allergies as their age increases? Yes, atopy or atopic dermatitis or eczema usually goes away by the one year of age. Food allergies, up to 70% of the food allergies like egg allergy, milk allergy, they go, go away as the age increases. Allergic rhinitis, it starts after three, year, three years of age and asthma also, frequent wheezing episodes during childhood, they also disappear by the age of five, five to six years in up to 90 to 95% of the cases. So how, <clears throat> how will you prevent these allergies from occurring? What uh, it starts during your pregnancy. Avoid smoking. You have uh, your diet should be healthy diet. You try for vaginal birth. It has a very good microbial uh, microbiota in your vagina, which carries on to your baby. It helps in the establishment of gut microbiota, which is which are good bacteria, and it decreases the incidence of allergies in the newborn period. Try breastfeeding as early as possible and do breastfeeding as long as possible. Even in, in our NICUs, we do give them with breast milk. We try to give them through nasogastric tube, whatever minimum is required. First, milk should be of mother's milk. That is the best thing to avoid allergies. Then is food allergies. Start around six months of age with variety of foods you should start. So avoid uh, smoking in the house, tobacco smoking, smokes, this has to be avoided. Avoid respiratory infection as far as possible. Uh, house molds, these are also a trigger for allergic disorder. This has to be avoided. Avoid antibiotics as far as possible. Whether we really need those antibiotics, that is the question. If they are not needed, we should avoid that. There is a role of prebiotics and probiotics. Prebiotics are the good bacteria which help in your immunity and also decreases your allergic disorders. Prebiotics are the foods which help in the growth of these good bacteria. Which are those foods? Uh, curd is a very good prebiotic. Uh, vegetables are very good probiotics. Uh, these are and healthy diet. This has to be given. Uh, it helps you in building your immunity and decreases allergic disorders. So the take home messages are try to breastfeed as early as possible and as long as possible. Offer variety of foods around six months of age. Offer them lot of allergens. Take them around and you should be good about it. Thank you so much.